morning ladies and gentlemen in this video i just want to quickly show you how to create a usd gbp and euro accounts for free and what will you be needing this for you will need it for you may need it for uh receiving your royalties from book sales maybe probably on amazon or for freelancing work or gigs done on platforms like fiverr upworks and co so right now i'd like you to check the screen i'm on a browser right now so i'll be imputing an address here so there's a company called gig pay dot africa so that's what we're going to do so just follow me through <clears throat> just a minute excuse me all right as you can see global banking for africa's professional create usd virtual bank accounts to easily receive international payments for your work plus a usd virtual debit card for your global spending so right now i will be opening this dialog box where the links is being embedded so what i'm going to do here is to click on create account create account so let me click that very quickly so that we create an account right now <clears throat> excuse me so there are two kinds of accounts you can create you can create account as an individual and you can create account as an organization a corporate account which can be in US dollar, Great Britain's pounds, and Euro. So as an individual and as a company, you can do that. Let me toggle the two. I'm a freelancer, you are self-employed and operate under your own name. Under your own name. Uh, I am a Nigerian and I'm actually doing this from Nigeria. That's why you are seeing Nigeria here. If you are from another country, all you need to do is to click on this place and choose your country. So, for example, I mean, for now, this account can be created in Ghana, in Kenya, in Nigeria, Tanzania, and Uganda. I'm in Nigeria, so I still choose my country, Nigeria. So, if you are a country, I mean, company as well, all you need to do is to as well do the same thing. So, as a company, you can create from several other countries as a company so majority majorly you know all countries of the world can create a corporate account there so but i still stay with the freelancer i'm a freelancer so i click on continue so let me click on continue right now so now that i've clicked continue so you will enter your details. So gig pays by Rainest. So as you can see, they are asking me for email address and referral code. I already have an account, but I'm doing this for the purpose of those who may need to open an account for now. So let me use one of my other email. Or look at the email at yahoo.com. So my Rainest refer now code is my Rainest ID, which is Adema sixty forty A D E M M A six zero four zero. So with this one, I just quickly go continue. Okay, we've sent you an email. So what I'll do is just to quickly go to where the email is. I've opened that down already before. So let me go out of here because that was done before. Let me go out of here. This is my Yahoo mail. Let me go out of here. Let me see whether they send a new one because that have been sent before. Okay. All right. 3087043087 3087 is the code. So I go back. Let's go. 
Let's see what happens. Three zero three zero eight. Let me check it again. Seven zero four. Seven zero four. So now that it's there, it's automatically verifying me. So it's saying create password. Create password. I'm going to pause this so quickly put my password and and go ahead. Just a minute. Now I've created my password. I'm continuing now. Okay, I can save it as well. You can see your account has been created successfully. Okay. Can you see welcome? Oh, good. That's it. So I will now like, okay, our virtual MasterCard is available. Your initial MasterCard replacement fee will be waived if you already possess an active MasterCard. Our virtual MasterCard is now active. So that's not why I'm here for now. Let me get out of here. So what you need to do, so you must be on, please complete each section below to manage your account profile. This will help us offer you an improved and tailored service. So personal profile. So all you need to do is to do all these ones. I'm not going to continue with this. I'm not going to continue with this. But if you don't continue with this, you will not be shown how to create your you know, bank accounts. You know, you know, you'll not be shown how to create your bank account. But what I'm going to do now is to leave here. But as a new person registering, you do all of these ones. Your personal profile. You're going to work on your personal profile. Employment details. Bank account details. Then you verify your identity. After you must have done with that. So let me go back to this place. To go back to my home account let me let me go come here git pay dot africa i want to show you my accounts okay i'm on desktop mode so let me go back to mobile mode Let me go back to Bombay mode. So what I have left in my account for now is what you can see. So I have created all my accounts. So as you can see here, receive payment in USD, receive payments in pounds, receive payment in euro. So what I'm going to do here is to click on each of them. Look at this. This is my USD account details, for example. If I click on this, okay, I don't have an account here. So set up a bank account. This works just like regular. You will be given, okay, that this this, this one even make it very good. So transfer usually takes one to three business days. Fees are applicable. Use for local bank transfer within UK. In, okay, this is good. So let me say create. What I'm going to do now is to create. I think they canceled the former GPB account. So let me create now. So this will be an, a very good example. Verify bank details to proceed. Fill in your bank details below. Select bank. Okay. Let me just fill my... Just a minute. Okay, as you can see, it brought out my account. So what I want to do now is I will put, impute my BVN, but I will go off and come back to continue. Just, just a minute. So let me click on create now. 
I've done what they wanted me to do. Please fill in your employment details. Amazon KDP, United States. So, occupation. So, all of these ones are what you're going to do and save them to continue. I don't want this thing to be unnecessarily long. I like to stop here. That's just what to do. Once you do that, you have seen my US bank account created already. So, those are just what you need to do. Once you do that one, you have an account. Thank you very much. God bless you.